Did you know that dividend-paying stocks have historically outperformed non-dividend-paying stocks by nearly 2% annually? Over time, that seemingly small difference can result in huge gains. But why are dividend stocks so powerful? Stick around, because today we're uncovering the hidden power of dividend investing. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into a topic that many investors often overlook, dividend investing. While many focus on stock price appreciation and market timing, dividends provide a steady and reliable way to build wealth over time. In fact, it's one of the best strategies for growing your investment portfolio, especially if you're in it for the long haul. So why are dividends so important, and how can you maximize their potential to grow your wealth? Let's explore. To understand why dividend investing is so powerful, let's take a quick look at its history. Dividends have been paid by companies for centuries, with early roots in the 17th century when the East India Company paid out profits to its shareholders. Over time, dividends became a cornerstone of investing in mature companies. In the stock market today, dividends represent a company's commitment to returning value to shareholders, signaling financial health and stability. Over the decades, dividend investing has evolved. While some view it as a traditional strategy, others have seen its potential for steady, compound growth. In fact, some of the wealthiest investors, including Warren Buffett, have used dividends as a key part of their investment strategy. So, what exactly makes dividend investing so powerful? Let's break it down with three key principles. Dividend yield The dividend yield is the percentage of a company's stock price paid out as dividends. For example, if a stock is priced at $100 and pays a $5 dividend annually, its yield is 5%. High dividend yields can provide significant cash flow, but remember, higher isn't always better. Sometimes a high yield can indicate potential issues within the company. Payout ratios Next, we have the payout ratio, which shows how much of a company's earnings are paid out as dividends. A healthy payout ratio, typically between 40-60%, suggests the company is balancing returning profits to shareholders while reinvesting in growth. However, an extremely high payout ratio could mean the company is stretching itself thin. The power of reinvesting dividends finally, and perhaps the most important, is the concept of reinvesting dividends. By reinvesting your dividends to buy more shares, you're taking advantage of compound growth. Each dividend payment buys you more shares, which in turn generates more dividends. Over time, this snowball effect can massively grow your investment without any additional capital from your pocket. Now, let's address some of the common misconceptions about dividend investing. A lot of people believe that investing in dividend-paying stocks limits growth potential. While it's true that some high-growth companies don't pay dividends, dividend-paying companies often offer a more stable investment. In fact, many dividend aristocrats, Companies that have increased their dividends for 25 consecutive years or more, have also seen strong stock price growth over time. Another challenge is market volatility. Just because a company has a history of paying dividends doesn't mean it's immune to market downturns. Companies can reduce or cut dividends if they face financial struggles. But this is why it's crucial to do your research and ensure you're investing in quality companies with a strong track record of dividend stability. So, how can you successfully navigate the world of dividend investing? Here are a few strategies to get you started. Identify quality dividend stocks Look for companies that have a solid history of paying and growing their dividends. Dividend aristocrats, companies that have increased their dividends for 25 consecutive years, are a good starting point. They have a strong track record of financial stability and shareholder returns. Diversify your portfolio Don't put all your eggs in one basket. It's important to diversify your dividend stock portfolio across different sectors and industries. This way, if one industry faces a downturn, your entire portfolio isn't impacted. Focus on total return Remember, dividend investing is not just about the yield. Consider the total return, which includes both dividend payouts and stock price appreciation. Balancing between dividend income and capital growth can help you build a more resilient portfolio. To sum it up, dividend investing is one of the most powerful tools you can use to grow your wealth over time. By focusing on dividend yield,
payout ratios, and reinvesting your dividends, you can take advantage of the compound growth that this strategy offers. While there are challenges, like market volatility and misconceptions about growth, dividend investing remains a reliable and time-tested strategy for long-term financial success. So, have you started investing in dividend stocks? If not, now is a great time to research and start incorporating them into your investment strategy. Comment below if you're already a dividend investor and share your favorite stocks. Also, don't forget to check out our other videos on stock market basics and strategies to build long-term wealth. Hit the like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you don't miss our next video.